Hello, hello. I'm sorry guys, but it's happened again. I had another recording mishap. For some reason, I uh, I hit record to start this episode and two minutes in, the recording just stopped. Um, and I didn't realize until I had been recording for about 20 minutes already. So in that time, I did actually make myself a silver jetpack which is currently on charge, is charged up in here. <laughs> so to try and fix the faux pas, we're going to make another jetpack with all of the materials that I have in here, which I don't actually mind. It, it'll be useful to have two anyways, because the reason I decided to make a jetpack was to make it easier to hunt for the Botania flowers because that's what we're going to start delving into today. And I found that the jetpack kind of runs out fairly quickly despite having 1.2 million FE, but it's whatever. So <laughs> we'll grab another wooden jetpack. It takes a while to make lots of little bits together. So I'll just speed through this and then we can carry on with our day. And there's our wooden jetpack, which we then swap into copper. And then the copper swaps into silver. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> and then we can swap this one here for that one there and charge that one as well. Awesome. So, <laughs> I'm going to cut to when I realized the recording wasn't happening. So whilst I'm waiting for that to charge, you guys are going to be watching me flying around a little bit. So during the recording that I don't, don't have, I flew around over here and I stole some villagers. The recording that I do have, uh, I flew around over in this section over here. So that's the part that you guys are going to see now. And then when we come back, this will be, wow already fully charged that was insanely fast never mind this is so much nicer than having to boat or run around we're gonna have to make sure that we keep properly stacked up on charcoal or coal Hello. Are you friendly? You're friendly. Hello. Hi. Oh, that's not what I intended to do. But hi, you're coming home with me now. I was trying to turn the engine off is what I was trying to do. Ooh, ender pearl. Thank you. Angel heart vial resurrects you once and breaks. <laughs> Micro missiles. <laughs> okay. Yes, please. The end. Got that one again, hey? <laughs> These guys are just jumping ship. All right. Don't think we have enough juice in the tank to get us home. But we can at least try and make it over here. Oh, look at that. That that wasn't too bad. That's closer than I thought we were going to get. 
Okay, so before we go any further, we've managed to collect a heap of the flowers that we need. But we are missing a couple of colors to complete some stuff off. But I want to get some completion done before we carry on. Just on the off chance that we get some extra little bits and bobs. Oh, a sink. That's going to be useful. Awesome. Okay, so here we are. We've still got to find technically we have yellow but the tall yellow flower apparently doesn't count towards ticking this off that's fine we'll just have to find um a, a smaller one we need to find gray oh just yellow and gray awesome so these will just give us a heap of points Oh, and we get a flower pouch after I've already made one. Dang it, I should have looked at that first. So the reason I want to get into Botania is so that I can use a Master Infusion Crystal and the Manufactory Halo together to combine all of my Inferium Essences because you know, manually doing it is a pain in the butt. Why not automate it? But in order to get there, I need to work out how to make mana pearls. Now, I already have mana steel from looting boxes, so I got quite lucky with that one. But I need to gather enough mana in a mana pool to convert the ender pearls that we found into mana pearls. And then I'll also need to do the same with a diamond into a mana diamond to be able to make this bad boy. So I think the first thing we need to do is make this petal apothecary. And I'm going to go and pop this outside. Oh, right there. Okay, so we need to make a pure daisy to start with. Yes. Woohoo! Okay, you can... And then we surround this in stone. And eventually that will convert into... I believe it's called living stone is what we're going to need to make the mana pool so for our endo flame we want two brown one red and a light gray two brown one red a light gray hey there we go makes us an endo flame awesome source let's grab ourselves a pick and boom thank you Look at us ticking everything off. I'm gonna plonk this down here for a moment. And I think I need a spreader? Question mark. Oh, we need living wood for that. Okay, we can do that. Boom. All right, there's our mana spreader. Now, I'm not 100% certain how far this needs to sit away. I'm curious to know how this works. All right, well, that burnt it. I think I'm missing something here. I just thought of something. There's a wand. Or something... Oh! What on earth is it called? This. Wand of the forest. 
Mm, let's go this way. One, I think this is what I'm looking for. And then I right click this. Why are you going over here? Link. <gasps> yes, okay. We're getting somewhere. This makes me happy. We might need to make some more endo flames, but this makes me happy. It's probably going to take quite a lot, I would imagine. Ah, oh, it's like, that's telling me there's not enough in there. That's okay. We can maybe make another endo flame. We'll have a look at what we've been winning. Oh, crikey, we've ticked a lot off. Okay. Oh my days, that just opened up a huge thing. What on earth? A block of coal. Awesome, let's go chuck that on it. How are we looking? Wow, you got through that. And... Oh! Yes! Okay. This is awesome. That means... I believe we should be able to... Make the first part. So the assembly halo. Yes! Okay. I'm going to go chuck that block of coal on here oh guys we can make it ah oh, that's gonna make life so much easier because we can have our little crafting auto crafting in it oh this is amazing you can live in there for a moment. Until we get the Master Crystal, we're not going to be able to do too much with that. But that makes me extremely happy, knowing that's how far we've come with it already. For now, we are going to... have to keep manually making some stuff. We have four Supremium Essences now, so we could make that or we could we could make the diamond seeds then we're going to need one more supremium i think i'm going to push for the crystal that's what we're going to have to do i think we should go go for a little hunt see if we can find the last two flowers maybe or we could go caving but we could go down somewhere like this Yeah, we could. Am I? Aha! Perfect. Mining montage, yes!
You're just gonna hurt yourself to death. Perfect. Thank you. Really? <laughs> that was not worth it. Any bows? I love the shield. Together. Need one of you to die so I can eat. What did we actually get and is it worth it? What do we get? Potion of night vision, potion of swiftness. Like, not the worst, but seriously, <laughs> not the best. Oh, my days is two over there. One down there. And another. Oh, my days are so many. Let's try not to die in lava. Oh! Dies in lava anyway. Can we stop burning, please? Thank you. Ah! Creeper, hello. Ah! Diamond! Back up before we run out of juice and I end up in lava. Oh, we got a present. What's the present? Oh, 
Wrong button. Frostbite 3. Meh. Ah, oh, so much more Inferium. Oh, I was going to go out exploring again. Never mind. Alrighty, now that that is over and done with, the Blood Moon has finally set. We've emptied out our backpack and tidied everything away. Now, before I end the episode, I would like to just make a little cow pen here, maybe. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Pop that there. Just in case. Because I found some of these arcane crystals whilst we were down in the mines. And I believe I need to do one of these with four spawner pieces to make a quantum catcher. And I think... If I just right click on an entity, it should collect it. Now, I hadn't anticipated starting on this quest line, but I do believe it would be in our benefit to have some cows. We're going to need lots of leather for things later on. Let us go see if we can grab one. Little cows, hello! Ha! <laughs> Entity, Minecraft cow, perfect! Now is it just a right click to put him back? Yes, okay! The cow collecting shall begin! I do believe you. You're coming with me. Oop. Thank you. Awesome. There we go. So the cow collecting can begin. Let's uh, gather up some wheat. Oh. Nope. Okay, we can't FTB mine. Never mind. You. Perfect. Ah, <sighs> okay. Nine uses left. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, we're up to six pieces. We are very slowly getting there. Very, very slowly. All right, so the last thing we need to do is tick some things off. What did we find? And thanks. We, we, we get an oak log. That's... Very anticlimactic, considering everything else that we've done today. But yeah, thank you for joining me today, guys. I'm sorry I had yet another episode with some recording issues, but I promise I will try and do better. I have another monitor on order at the moment, so when that arrives, at least I'll be able to see if I'm actually recording or not. So, yay. <laughs> but yeah, we've got Botania started. We've done a little bit more progress on our mystical agriculture essences 
hopefully next episode we might be able to make that master infusion crystal and then we can combine it with the manufacturing halo to get some auto crafting on the go and in between episodes i might try and come up with a little design idea for a waystone area and maybe a small greenhouse as well so that we can really start stacking up on some inferium as soon as possible yeah thank you again guys i hope this one wasn't too bad to watch and uh, i'll catch you in the next one bye bye